Jackson. In terms of your bidder agreement with Barrett Jackson, if you have any questions, the assistants at the bidder's office will be able to instruct you on what to do after you have purchased items from the block. Barrett Jackson would ask that if you are not bidding or examining an item, that you not linger on the auction stage so as to allow everyone who is interested in the item an opportunity to examine their chosen item. Please understand there are a lot of items, cars, trucks, and so forth that enter on and exit from the auction floor. Barrett Jackson asks that you pay close attention to these activities to avoid injury or damage to property. Fire Marshal requests no smoking in the auction arena or any indoor facility. If there's any condition that you believe is unsafe, please report it immediately to a Barrett Jackson official. If you are bidding at the Scottsdale 2014 Barrett Jackson Collector Car event, you are participating in the world's greatest collector car auction. Good luck and good bidding. Time now to meet your official Barrett Jackson auction crew. By way of introduction, my name is Kurt Becker. I'm from Alabama, Illinois. I'll be joined by Dave Stansberry of Clarksville, Tennessee. And now, let's meet your auction clerks from Canyon, Texas, Nick Wilson. From Norman, Oklahoma, Brian Kelby. From New Braunfels, Texas, Anthony Weeks. From Canyon, Texas, Thompson Mayberry. From Tulsa, Oklahoma, Rob Hart. From Lexington, Kentucky, Blake Ferguson. From Arlington, Texas, Craig Davis. From Mentone Beach, California, Mark A. Thorne. Your bidder is distance from Weatherford, Texas, Scott Farmer. From Edmond, Oklahoma, Chisholm Kinder. From Stephenville, Texas, Chris Orr. From Fisherville, Kentucky, Jim Price. From Zionsville, Indiana, Dan Mahaney. From Canyon, Texas, Ryan Brewer. From San Antonio, Texas, E.C. Larkin. From Stephenville, Texas, J. Brian Davis. From New Braunfels, Texas, Gary Holland. From Valley View, Texas, Ty, Doc McClary. From J. Oklahoma, Wade Cunningham. From Prospect, Texas, Ty D. Cordova. From Plano, Texas, Texas State Champion Auctioneer Bob Dickerson. From Wortham, Texas, Tom Johnson. From Jackson, Tennessee, Joshua Beaver. From T, Texas, Clinton Little. From Fort Worth, Texas, Ralph Beans. From New Braunfels, Texas, Cash Murphy. From Maynardville, Tennessee, Phil Richardson. From New Holland, Pennsylvania, Pennsylvania State Champion Auctioneer Patrick Morgan. From McLeod, Oklahoma, Mitchell Armitage. From Lakeville, Minnesota, Angela Lopez. From New Holland, Pennsylvania, Roger Spencer. From Fairfield, Texas, James Grant. From Guthrie, Oklahoma, Oklahoma State Champion, Whitey Mason. From Fairfield, Texas, Clint Minshew. From Canyon, Texas, International Champion, Amy Assiter. From Surprise, Arizona, Bill Stewart. Your seller ambassadors from York, South Carolina, Jeff Fritch. From Eaton, Colorado, Colorado State Champion, Scott Schumann. From King George, Virginia, Virginia State Champion, Kelly Strauss. Your auctioneers from Clayton, Indiana, Indiana State Champion, T.J. Preji. Reserve World Automobile Champion out of Lakeland, Florida, Harold Brown. From Millersburg, Ohio, Ohio State Champion and International Champion, Joseph Matt. Texas State Champion, World Champion Automobile Team Auctioneer from Cobbell, Texas, Joe Lambert. Virginia State Champion, World Automobile Champion, International Champion out of Fredericksburg, Virginia, John Nichols. And Texas State Champion, World Automobile Now we will turn things over on the auction stage to our own Amy Assiter. Very recently there has been a, an albeit small group, a group of people who have begun speaking out about the anthem and how they would like to have it removed as our national anthem. Uh, because it is a sign, it is a song of wartime. Well, I hate to tell them, but we've been in a wartime for quite some time. And this country and all of its veterans and its military and its citizens believe that the things that we have as citizens are worth fighting for. Just like these men on the edge of the stage that you see this morning. They're protecting your freedoms. Will you please give them a round of applause? If you're a veteran this morning or active duty military and you're just standing around where you can hear us, will you please rise or raise your hand? Show us who you are. If you're a veteran or active duty military, we love you guys. You are a huge part of us here at Barrett Jackson. You are a tradition. You are one of our, our greatest priorities is honoring you. So this morning, would you all please rise? Place your hand over your heart if you are an American. And Canadians, I have to tell you, we love you too. And we, these men and women are fighting for your freedom just as much as they're fighting for ours. And I know your soldiers are fighting for ours as well. 
If you're an American, will you please place your hand over your heart and join us as we sing for that flag, that wartime song. Oh, say, can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight o'er the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming and the rocket's red glare the bombs bursting That our flag was still there. Oh, say, does that star spangled banner yet wave or the Thank you, Amy, and thank you one and all. Our auction crew getting ready to report to their positions around the arena. Gary Bennett, what a great way to start here yesterday, and we're just getting started for the week. Oh, Kurt. Ladies and gentlemen, good morning. I want to personally welcome you to Barrett-Jackson on behalf of Craig Jackson, Steve Davis, and the Barrett-Jackson family. It, yesterday was awesome. We rocked. It was, it was amazing. We got out of here last night, and, and we all are just reeling from how great it was, and, and today is going to be another one just like yesterday, if not better. So, thank you for being here. I hope you have a great time. Pace yourselves around here. It's going to get warm outside, but enjoy yourselves. More importantly, this is all about you. So, thank you for being here.